before you are should do a relationship you should learn to learn about yourself you should not focus on somebody's appearance you should focus on somebody's character is the person a good person or are you just attracted to their appearance are you just lusty or is that the okay. case. Ask yourself all these questions. If the things you are thinking about how you feel about somebody are truly the things you feel or they are just in your mind, just an illusion created by your hormones. The question you should ask yourself if you if the person did ha not have a body, do you still be attracted to them? Are you truly want to have them in your life still? If you not can touch them, if you don't can look at them, if they're just a spirit, just energy, maybe weird way of looking at it, which after if you don't do that, if you don't want to be in that life and anymore. Then you are just attracted to that body. By the way, why want you to have a relationship? Why are you not just happy on yourself? Why have you to have somebody in your life? I think that you are not ready to have a relationship. If you are not can be happy on yourself, also. you must remember nobody that can make you happy. The only person that can make you happy is yourself because happiness comes from the inside. It comes from being satisfied with the stuff you have. In contrary of making a black hole of your own mind, of your own heart, that sucks any light inside and that lets anything ever to satisfied or close their black hole. It is time that you are truly starting to learn yourself. Because if you are not knowing this, your own nature, you not can evolve, you don't can become better. And yes, you can always improve. You don't have to be the person you are now today. Why should you choose, for example, cruelty over compassion? Sacrificing. Love is sacrificing also. True love is caring more about others than you care about yourself. Put, can Putting yourself apart uh, from it, putting your own needs away. When it is time, I don't care for myself. I don't think I'm not important. I don't think anybody important of our species because I don't look things from. Uh, anthropocentric way. I am a um, biocentrist. I look things from the whole world perspective. That's confusing for many people because many people have an anthropocentric point of view. They are they are watching the world from their own position first and foremost, and then an extending process is what follows. So anything that is closer to them, for example, their dog or cat, is more war. Is uh, worth more than a um, pig in the forest or one deer or an elephant far away in another country because it does not affect you directly. That's narrow minded. Anthropocentrism is narrow minded. Biocentrism is actually a mindset that focuses on the well being of the plant. It is not focused only on our species. 
it seeks to live in harmony. The mindset of that's mindset. If you want to know more about biocentrism, or why biocentrism is the superior mindset for well peace, for justice, maybe ask me enough in the questions and or. I will do it. When darkness and light become one, the reality is split in a way and the truth become visible. 